Edward Walsh, the head of the international banking system, suddenly dies. To my beloved wife, Sarah, I leave the Walsh Enterprise Tower in $15 million. To my sons, Michael, Thomas, and Richard, I leave property on the Riverside in $5 million each. Oh, Daniel, you're late. Come here. Children, I love you very much. In order to succeed in life, you have to know before whom you stand. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. To his youngest son, he leaves his legacy. And to my youngest son, Daniel, I bestow my pocket watch. There's a message behind this. It reads here that Edward Bloomfield is the illegitimate son of a wealthy Jewish patriarch. If that's correct, our father had another identity. Your father gave you that watch for good reason. Go to London and track down the rest of the Bloomfield family. A father's mysterious past. Your secret is safe with me. Becomes his son's greatest journey. Does anyone else know about the scroll? A family's greed bleeds through. A lawyer's deadly intentions boil to the surface. You're all hired for the same reason by three different brothers. I'll pay you double. Give me the scroll by whatever means necessary. I make the rules. Things will be done my way. And one last thing. The job must be completed. In search of the truth, no one can be trusted. You've been looking at me for the last hour. What do you want with him? The pocket watch. What do you, what do you want? They're after my father's wealth! <sighs> Give me the straw! The other half is in Jerusalem. We have to find Rabbi Makir. It will be hard to get you into Jerusalem, but I know a man who can get both of your British passports. Hurry, Daniel, hurry! far stretches of the earth and uncover a legacy buried in the past. I can translate the code. Where's the scroll? Don't listen to him, Daniel. We'll all burn in hell if we don't get the scroll. Save the Torah! Sludge, where are you? For whom you stand. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. The scroll.